Uh huh, exactly. Oh, look, another thing I could use. I guess I'm might and welcome to the console. Now, the console is a game that I wanted to play for a very long time, though I didn't want to because the old rig would have some difficulties. Now, with the new rig, I think we are finally ready to play this game. Now, you're probably like wondering what the hell is this? This is basically a Delta game, which means that you are, uh, I won't spoil the name of the character yet. You participate in an event on an island of a secret society and based on your decisions you will get different results, just like the Delta. Though the difference in this game is that the consequences here actually matter and also the role playing game uh, elements involved. There are historical figures over here such as Washington and Bonaparte for example, however the events are completely made up. So just so you're gonna be aware of this thing and don't go to school and tell this bullshit because this is gonna completely make you grounded or whatever. So just you're gonna keep this thing in mind. Now I've saved this game some time ago, I found it really bloody interesting, it looks just gorgeous and I just cannot wait to roll into it and hopefully you guys are gonna enjoy it so let me know what you think. No, I'm not gonna ask you for likes at the very five minutes of the beginning of the video. So, as you can see, haven't played this thing an inch. There will be in total five episodes. I think at the moment I have two. The remaining episodes will just like appear as the game will get new updates. So, without further ado, new game. France. Paris. December 10th, 1792. Stop! You're not getting anywhere with this Von Borschert. You know, I kind of get the same feeling, my dear Sarah. Listen. Nothing. Not a sound. No one's coming to save you. Huh, that's what you think. The Golden Order knows exactly where we are. <laughs> By the time your ridiculous secret society turns up, I'll be long gone. As for you, nothing will remain of your body. If you touch a single hair of my mother's head, I'll skin you alive. You know, Louis, I have no intention of beating your dear mother. There are more persuasive ways of making you talk. You've stolen something from me that I intend to get back. Where have you hidden it? Von Borschert, you can't sell that book on the black market anymore. This is finished. We know you're planning on selling at one of Lord Mortimer's parties. All right? Just tell us who the buyer is and we can make a deal. You've no idea of the trouble you've gotten yourselves into. Oh, but you will tell me where it's hidden. I can promise you that. Oh, stop annoying our host, Louis. Son, didn't what happened to you in Rome teach you anything? Just a few more minutes and my concoction will be ready. With this, your bodies will dissolve in less than four hours. You'll see. It loosens tongues in no time. You know, I have to admit, Mother, the only thing you've ever taught me is that damn motto of yours. Always remain rational. And open. I got it. I've opened our shackles. Draw him over here. I'll take care of him. Von Borchard! Von Borchard! Hmm? Listen, let's make a deal. I'll tell you where the book is if you let my mother go free. Oh, what are you playing at? Don't worry, mother. You want to play the hero. Pity you're not in any position to do so. For the last time. Where is Alazif? Let me do this. Trust me. Okay, so decisions matter, remember that. We can trust your mother or we can try to act. Okay, well, let's try to trust her. Please, be my guest, mother. Mm. Oh! Uh. 
Oh. Shot him. Shot him already, woman. Well, chat also works. Well done, Louis. You reacted perfectly. How do you feel, mother? Couldn't be better. He's alive, so I can question him after we get back. Pity he's just a middleman. Hmm. Means I haven't finished with this case. Oh, I had a feeling you'd be running off on one of your adventures again, mother. You know what? I'm warning you. This time, I'm coming with you. No. Even though you impress me more and more, I have to do this on my own. Mother, you're no spring chicken anymore. Come on, let's go home. <laughs> and don't forget to send our men to tend to Von Borchert. Smack him away! Never mind, okay, whatever. Now, I've noticed that the lip sync doesn't actually, like, follow. Maybe I need to tweak the settings a little bit more. I don't know, we're gonna see. One month later! January 5th, 1783. Lord Mortimer Island of the coast of England. So this is basically the, let's say, place of events of the Hidden Society and the main game. Focus Interactive and Science Presents. A game back beat. Bat Wolf Studio. <laughs> you cannot go wrong with a name like that, don't you? Oh shit. This is gonna be nice. Well done, mother. You just had to pick up Von Bertrand's trail on your own, didn't you? You ditch me in Paris with no explanation, and off you go to infiltrate one of the world-renowned receptions of this Lord Mortimer? And now he writes me to say that you've gone missing on his private island? Which, by the way, looks more like a big rock than a paradise island. The Council. Episode 1! The Mad Ones. Are we gonna see about that? The least he could do is explain to me how he managed to lose you. In any case, it is time for you to stop all this, mother. It no longer suits your age. Well, I'm sure I'll find you once again, slogging through the caves beneath the island, searching for some long-lost mystical object that you just can't live without. I'm already hating this trip, and all I've done is think about it. what one may be able to imagine, it was not the host himself who invited me. Well now, Duchess, we find ourselves both invited by Sir Hall. Well, how very amusing. Perhaps we have some common interests, Your Eminence. Is this your first time at one of Lord Mortimer's legendary parties? Oh, no. We have been friends since long ago. But as I'm doing some business with Sir Hone, the invitation came from him. Well, I simply can't wait for all the festivities to begin. And you, good sir, what brings you here? Is this the Pope? Business with Lord Mort personal reasons. Uh, okay. Good thing I don't have like a cooldown. Okay, business with Lord Mortimer. I think. Kind of. Well, that's like the official statement. Well, technically I'm here for personal reasons because my mother got missing. Hmm. But okay, if I'm gonna be close then people will get suspicious. Lord Mortimer asked me to join him. We have some business to take care of. Oh, how mysterious. You adapt quickly, my son. You get along here like a fish in water. Would you believe that we are all here hoping to solve our personal issues? You'll see. Right. I doubt that you came here to look for your mother, your eminence. Anyway, consider yourself fortunate, young man, because there are many who dream of simply one day setting foot on this island, and only a very few ever make it. Indeed, I imagine this must be your first time here. Uh, kinda. Turn the question back to the Duchess. Absolutely. Okay, remain mysterious for now. And you, Duchess? You seem to be quite accustomed to things here. Am I right? I do not think that one can ever get accustomed to what Lord Mortimer prepares for his guests. But you are right. This is not the first time I've been on this wharf. If you've come back again, I imagine you must find it to be of some interest. Here, everything is possible if you make the right choices. It really is up to you whether you leave better off or not. Please excuse me if you find me overly curious, young man. 
I did not mean to cause you any embarrassment. Come, Duchess. They are waiting for us. We're moving, Monsieur de Richet, if you would like to join us. How do you know my name? I'm coming, Duchess. A cardinal? A Duchess? No wonder if all the guests here are this prestigious. If I'd known, I, I would have gone for a better suit. <laughs> what? Are you alright? No, I'm just going crazy. Oh, that happens when you forget to drink alcohol for a long time. Just saying. What Mother? in the... Oh shit, your hand! So? Okay, it's done. Did you put it in a safe place? Yes. I made sure no one was following me. Don't worry, Sarah, no one's going to find it. Are you absolutely sure? Yes, I'm sure. Right. Just one thing left to do. No, Mother, no, don't, don't! What? Have you lost your mind? There is no other way. If you, if you kill me, you won't find it. That is the point, my dear. No one must ever put their hands on it again. No. But I trusted you. No, Sarah. Don't. No. No! <gasps> you can run if you want to, Sarah. But you will pay Oh, great. I'm nose bleeding. Have some. <laughs> this is not normal. You. Uh, Louis, are you all right? What's going on? Oh, uh, nothing. I'm just bleeding from my nose. Here, take this. I'm sorry. Keep it. Are you better? I'm fine. Don't worry. It's getting late. Why don't why don't you go on ahead and I'll catch up with you, okay? Are you sure? Yes. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sure, yes. Fine. Christ, did you save the textures of her boobs? <laughs> My god! <laughs> oh, no freaking... I definitely have to find Mother quickly. Yeah, you don't say. Am I going crazy or, or what? Awesome. This can't be real. The, the Duchess arrived with me. What's happening to me, for God's sake? I absolutely need to find you, Mother. I can move freely. Oh, this is gonna be so cool. Uh, okay. I, I thought for a second I cannot go over here. Okay, what's this? Can I pick up some of those things? I don't know. Luggage. Excuse me! Somebody forgot to take my luggage! I have precious things over here. Mostly my underwear. This is really bloody impressive. Okay, I'm still bleeding from my nose. Uh, wait. Let me just, like, go to the light. No, I'm not. Okay, great. Uh, is there, like, something useful over here? Something I need to, like, gather. Like, some information. Some items. What's this? Nothing I can do with this thing. Can I run? I can! Have some! Ho 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 This is gonna be cool, man. I cannot wait to dive deep into this game. Louis, during the trip, I had something I wanted to ask you, but we didn't happen to run into each other. Yes, Duchess? I'm not sure if you remember, but we've met before. At that time, you were of two minds as to your choice of career. Tell me, what have you been up to since? Oh yes, I forgot completely. This has a roaring playing game elements. That means you have to actually pick a fucking class. Oh shit! Okay, the detective. Question, intelligence, psychology, agility, logistics. Manipulation, occultism, erudition, science, subfortiness. Politics, etiquette, uh, linguistics, conviction, diversion. Okay. I think I'm gonna go with oculist. I can like wonder, can you roll like a uh, Constantine type guy from DC Comics? That would be cool. <laughs> I mean, he was technically like a detective oculist, so... Well, he was actually all three of them, so let's go with the middle one and hope for the best. Ooh, okay, I have three points available. Wait, can I pick the other one as well? I can like wonder. That would be cool, okay. Uh, rally on your knowledge of myths, occult and religious symbols, as well as, as ancient language and secret societies. Benefit from sound cultural background in the arts, geography and history. Be up to date with scientific knowledge and medical techniques. This is occultism? Really? 
And this track is still items, pick locks, notice, falsification. Ooh, that's nice. Manipulation, get people to act in your own interest. Okay, I'm gonna go with this thing. I'm gonna go with uh, arts, geology, and history. And I'm gonna go in, let's say, myths, occult, and religious symbols. Okay, that's it. I think it's gonna be okay. How do I press space bot? Awesome. Now what? I have been involved in all sorts of unsolved cases. Have you ever heard of the Abbey of Hexham? Uh, vaguely. An ingenious scam involving mass manipulation on a scale never seen before. Hmm. There was a cavern under the Abbey, wasn't there? Exactly. The wind would blow in through spouts, creating a, a terrifying howling sound. So, to stop the howling, the priests called for offerings from the peasants. And if they brought enough money, I'm guessing the priests stopped the howling. A perfect trick to fool simple souls. Admit it, Duchess. That story kept you in suspense, didn't it? Yes, it did. I'm delighted to find out that you were the young and brilliant French investigator. For someone who only remembers the case vaguely, your memories are very clear. Well, they say I have the memory of two people. But please, call me Emily. Fine, Emily. Tell me. I was actually helped on that case by my mother. You wouldn't know her by any chance. Wait, Louis. We've already met. You do remember me, don't you? Uh, okay. Not at all. So, lie to her. Not at all, sorry. Oh. Okay, I'm not gonna lie to her. And also, I don't like the fact that he's sometimes looking somewhere behind her instead of, like, looking at her. I don't know why he's doing that thing. Please excuse me, madam. I'm sure we've met before, but I don't remember where. Hmm. I appreciate your honesty, even if it's not very flattering for me. I know. I imagine that with your beauty, madam, it's the first time a man hasn't remembered your face. Well, I must say, you make up for yourself rather elegantly. Please stop torturing me. I'm completely at your mercy. Where have we met? Four years ago, in London? No. Sorry, I, I don't remember. In the office of William Pitt. Remember? No? I'm so sorry, Emily, but I really don't remember you. Let's drop it, Louis. It doesn't matter. Right, time to go to the manor. I kind of like wonder that I picked the right thing. Opportunities. Your skill allow you to discover hidden details. Select an object that is most suggestive of the situation in order to discover them. Opportunities do not consume. Oh, okay. Effort points to access the skill required for this situation. You just need to have unlocked it. Okay. Her lips. I ask her a question, she answers with another. Is she playing with me? Okay, personality. Each person you met on the island has their own personalities, which makes them vulnerable to certain skills and immune to others. Exploring your personalities is critical to achieve your personal goals. Skill used against immunities will not succeed and leave you exhausted. Okay. Meanwhile, exploiting valuables will give you one effort point back. Review immunities and okay, journal of the menu, yada yada yada. yada. All right. Emily, please excuse my insisting, but you still haven't answered about my mother. Do you know her? You'll see, Louis. Everybody here knows Sarah de Richet. Oh, this is gonna be nice. I don't know where we're going like this, Emily, but you're connected to my mother one way or another. And if I can believe my vision, you don't have much of a place in her heart. Okay, we have to, like, notice everything in this game. You obtain talents from your credit out certain actions. Remember to review uh, the unlock conditions and effects as they offer very interesting improvements. Okay, we will it later on. Maybe like off screen or whatever. Okay, oh! Hello, hello, hello! Okay, nobody's watching? Is this guy watching? Yeah, he kinda is, but let's hope that he won't notice me. Roll jelly. Restores two effort points, you cannot carry more than five. Okay. Great. Honey. <laughs> oh, it's just honey! Uh oh. Must be an incredible view from up there. Impossible to set foot on the island without being seen from 300 meters away. Hmm, okay, that's nice to know. Alright, so I'm guessing I have to go that way, but we can try to go up here. Okay, you stay where you are, man! I'll go just this way, okay? Good evening, sir. May I ask your name, please? Louis Moraz de Richet. Monsieur de Richet, 
Delighted to welcome you among us, sir. You must be Sarah de Richet's son. I must tell you we are doing our utmost to find your mother as quickly as possible. Mm hmm Where's Lord Mortimer? What do you know about my mother? What can you tell me about the disappearance of my mother? Two weeks have passed since Sir's mother went missing. All the staff here have since been busy searching every nook and cranny of the island. But Sir may rest assured we shouldn't be long in finding her. And just what have you found so far? It would seem that Sir's mother may be hiding on the island and regularly changing her location. But no one seems to know why she would find this behavior necessary. What do you mean? On several occasions, we have found leftovers of food, a few of her things, or even traces of campsites. The reason why we are searching the wharf again is because lights were spotted there last night. Where we are now? Indeed, sir. According to our information, lights were seen in the middle of the night, sir. After verification, none of the guests seemed to have left the manor last night. We think that perhaps Sir's mother was here. Okay, skills. Your skills give you access to unique choices and actions on the cost of effort points. The higher your skill level, the lower the cost of effort points. Okay. Ah. Uh, have you found anything? Difficulty zero. Questioning locked. So I cannot pick this thing. Aha, so I had to like pick different things. Okay. Did anyone see anything else? Unfortunately not, sir. Only lights were seen by servants of the manor, sir. And as I was saying, sir, all the guests were asleep, and no one seems to have noticed anything at all. We seem to have found an object that would appear to belong to sir's mother. A handkerchief. The handkerchief is embroidered with the initials S. DR. We came to the conclusion that they are the initials of Sir's mother, Sarah de Richet. I have orders to give it to Lord Mortimer as soon as I see him. I know my mother. She's not the kind to go for a midnight stroll in the war for nothing. I've got to find out what the hell she was doing here. Where exactly did you find the handkerchief? On the landing dock, sir. The one you arrived by. Okay, can I do something with this? Difficulty convention locked, locked. Oh, but I can use this thing. Would you kindly give me the hand? Ah, oh, I can manipulate him. Okay. Pass me the handkerchief. But, but sir, my orders were to give it to my master. Are you refusing to give me my own mother's personal belongings? Even though she was greatly looking forward to meeting your master, she's gone missing. And you seem incapable of finding her. Oh, but sir, please. And to top it all off, you refuse to give me the handkerchief that she so often let me use? Do I deserve such little consideration in your eyes? Is that what you wish me to report to your master? No, certainly not, sir. Please forgive me, sir. I have been such an idiot. Here you are. He is good. <laughs> Item added to inventory. Mother's handkerchief. Okay. It is indeed your handkerchief, mother. You must have come here for a specific reason. I need to know what it is. Let's think. What could she have been doing out here on this wharf? Ah, investigation. Okay. Looks like the barrel's been broken for quite some time. Okay, hold down to move faster. Oh, okay, not too fast though. Oh, I see more. Wait, I want to go over there. Thank you. Much appreciated. What's this? Reality gel. Hmm, okay, this is not exactly the thing. <laughs> Going back to investigate, guys. I'll be later. See ya. Okay, some rope over here. Some rope? Apparently no one's touched it for a good long time. Okay, mother. What would you be looking here for? Let's see. I have this stupid feeling that this stupid globe over here is like actually important to something. Hmm. What she would need it here? Of course. The letter box. It was suspicious from the very beginning. Let's see what's hidden inside. Examine the letters, find a clue. Oh, okay, this is... Okay, stand back. Wait, is there like anybody around? Well, they could actually see me. Okay, let's, let's risk. Let's see what's hidden inside. Or maybe I should wait to get like this skill. Let's look. Okay, to Mr. Car Joey, to, uh, Dimbleford has indigrams on it. Examine the other letters. No! Swip, slip it. Address is 50 Bedford Square, London. Hmm. Is this like important? Someone. 
okay. Hmm. A letter written in an oriental language. Fuck, I don't know this language. The slightest idea what it says. Okay, I need to pick the language thingy. Talent. Okay. Let's look. Examine the rest? Maybe? So Mr. Car Corvey. It's too badly written, I I can't make out the address. Okay. Uh Kalibracht. The address is fifty. Ah, it's this one, okay. Can I skip? No. Oh. Oh, there's a map over here as well. Okay, that's nice. Uh okay. Mr. Joaquin de Silva Xavier. Uh oh. The address he's in Sao Paulo, Brazil. That reminds me. It's about time the order sent some envoys there. Okay, that's apparently important. Uh, His Eminence Giovanni Anglico Brasci. This envelope is meant for the Vatican. I know this name. Oh! Apparently, this letter is meant for Pope Pius VI, born Giovanni Brasci. I wonder which one of these people is influential enough to write to the Pope in person. Okay, that's a clue. Uh, Samuel Ritter Duchos. Names ring a bell. Samuel Ritter Duchois. <laughs> Mother, you test me even when you're not here. It's an anagram of Louis Moras de Richet. You wanted to write to me then. Let's see what's inside this letter. Found a clue. So. Dear Samuel, my stay on Lord Mortimer's Island is going wonderfully well. As I find myself in such charming company, I plan to stay a few more weeks. Would you be so kind as to send me a gift that I'd like to give to our old friend Manuel Godoy? I would be most grateful. I have been told that he's going to join us here soon. I would like to mark the occasion. Thank you in advance. Yours devotedly, Sarah Faustine de Richer. What is your game here, Mother? What are these strange turns of phrase? Never heard you speak like that. What's going on here? That you write to me under a pen name, okay. But here you go even further by trying to avoid raising any suspicions should anyone else read it. I wonder if this Godoy is the person you came looking for. Think. Godoy, Godoy, Mano Godoy. Why does the name sound so familiar? Ah, crap, I don't have politics. I don't remember. Manuel Godoy. I'm guessing he's a man of some importance. Spanish, I'd say. But. I just can't put a face to him. Well, hope we meet to talk about it soon, Mother. I don't know what you've gotten yourself into this time, but I'll bet you've got a lot to tell me. Okay, can I go back to investigate that thing? No, add the letter. Okay, wait, can I access that thing? Journal, inventory, letter. Can I somehow investigate this thing? Like, get the thing once again? Multimedia intervention, inventation. Okay, can I do anything with that thing? Can I do anything with this thing once again? Let's see. see. What's hidden inside? Yes, yes, yes. You already say that thing. Uh, examine the other letters. Okay. Nothing new over here. All right. So apparently. Okay, stand back. Okay, so I have the letter from mother with me. Right. Is like anything else over here? Interest? Oh wait, saw something. The lantern. Nothing special. Nothing special. Oh, you are not noticing something special. Cannot go over here. Uh, I don't think there's like anything else. Just keep an eye on open for like a thingy. But I don't think there's like anything else over here. Is it? Okay, this pile of those things. Something here. Okay, not go go down. Oh. A sack of seeds. It's unopened. No one seems to have used any. What's this? Looks like a bar from an old gate. This miserable old bar has been broken fairly recently. The edges are still clean, and the tip is blackened. Without analysis to the contrary, I put my money on cannon powder. Hmm. Take the bar? This might just come in handy. <laughs> I wonder where you're gonna hide it. You hide it somewhere. Okay, that's nice. And the final item is over here. This chest might belong to Duchess Hillsborough. Hmm, nothing interesting whatsoever from that thing. Okay. A gate, you say. 
But I think there's like a gate over there. So if I'm gonna go investigate. Yep, just as I thought. Missing bar. Okay, that means that mother could leave actually like a clue over here or something. Hello. Open the gate. I'll never get it open barehanded. Uh, pick lock. Ah. Ah ha ha. There you go. There we are. Yeah, th this gate is missing a bar, or this is like my imagine. Yeah, it's missing a bar. Look, see? There's like, there's a bar over here, bar over here, and then it's like the missing thingy. Okay, mother, please tell me you have left me some clues over here. What is this? Honey, I couldn't have hoped for better. Great. This looks like a pistol case, but it's empty. Looks familiar. Know if this has anything to do with you, mother? But if it does, at least now you're armed. Just like in my vision. And none of it's telling me anything useful. Well, nobody said that this is the vision from the past. It could be like a vision from the future. Hmm, this wharf is used as storage for a lot of barrels. Examine the barrels? Uh huh. What have we here? It's cannon powder. Uh huh. Exactly. Oh, look! Another thing I could use. Hmm, the powder's wet. Not surprising, given the dampness of the dog. It's unusable now. I don't know what the person who left this barrel like this had in mind, but it's a waste. Apparently, someone on this island has gone through a whole lot of trouble to arm themselves. I really must find you, dear mother, and quickly too. Okay, so mother got a pistol, she got wet gunpowder, and she's apparently alive. Okay, I don't think there's anything useful over here remaining. Oh. Amber fragments. You just found an amber fragment. Each time you pick up four of them, you increase the maximum effort points by one. Have some. Fragment of amber. Okay, I think I really pick up everything I could from this side. Let's go back. There's nothing interesting over here. Nice view. Oh my god, this island is actually quite big. Whoa, this is gonna take a lot of. Hello? Hey, there's something not right about this floorboard. It's different from the rest. You don't say. Examine. <laughs> okay, I cannot do that thing. Use the... Oh? Somebody replaced it recently. It looks like it's fixed pretty solidly in place. It's going to be tough to rip it out of here. Okay, let's use the rusty iron bar. Gently! That does it. Okay, that. Let's see what's hidden inside. That sequence flip There's it a, a little book bit. And also a bag. Woman's bag. The Mysterium Cosmographicum. I know that book well. Mother used to read passages from it to me all the time. And judging from what I can see, it's the same one as hers. For crying out loud! What's happened to you, Mother? Okay, manuscripts. Manuscripts allow you to educate yourself during the adventure. At the start of each quest, you can choose what to read and gain permanent skill points. Alright. Let's look inside the bag. A little food, a few toiletries, a small key, and some kind of black powder. Gunpowder. Examine the food. Some fruit, a piece of bacon, and some bread. The fruit's still firm. The bread's a bit stale. <laughs> From the smell, this food's been here roughly two days. And if it's rationed, there's enough left to last two more days. Hmm, okay. Examine the personal belongings. Shit. Those are definitely my mother's things. I recognize her hairpins. This bag smells of her perfume. A piece of soap. Some oils and her powder puff. What does all this mean? Okay, rusty key. An iron key completely rusted. Take the key. She left this thing here for rations, right? She may actually like, need this thing. She may need the key. Uh, I'd rather leave it all as it is. Uh, examine the powder. The bottom of the bag is covered in black powder. And judging by its consistency, it's the same type of powder that I found earlier. This just gets better and better. Okay, take the bag. Should I take the bag? Well, I need to hide it somewhere. But then again, there's food inside. 
I don't know will matter actually try to go back here. Ah. Uh, she may actually try to come back here, right? Right. That's enough. I think I better leave her bag here. If she hit all this, it's because she thought she might need it later. Yeah. This... So, let's go through this. My mother's been hiding pieces of bread between the rotten boards of the wharf in the middle of the night. That's not normal. And if that weren't enough, looks now like she's armed. Meanwhile, she also takes the time to send out letters, reassuring whoever might be interested that she's having a fabulous time here. So odd. So very odd. And that's not even all I've noticed. But maybe I had to move on to the manor now. They'll be waiting for me. Yeah, probably just... I hope so. <laughs> yeah, probably just like a good thing to do. Oh, wait, there's something over here as well. What's this? Had some noise. Latin inscription. Can you translate? And Nessis, mi fili quantilia produncia mundus vergatur. No idea. I can translate this thing. Fuck yeah, I'm so smart. You don't know, my son, how little wisdom the world is governed with. I tend to agree. Discovered immunity. Lord Mortimer. Well, well, well. Okay, and apparently this is gonna lead me to the uh, to the manor. Alright, so I think this is actually a good point to cut this episode here. Uh, I don't know how long this one will be. Sorry if it's gonna be like a little bit too short, but this is just to the introduction to the game. Really interesting. I really like it. I really like that you actually have to put skills and use them. And like decide, do you want to take this thing? Because normally in the games like this, you just grab everything. Everything that's literally not nailed to the freaking ground. You just take it and you hope you're gonna use it for, for the future. Well, most of the time you do. And here is like, you know, we have, for example, with the bag. Like, the mother hit the bag here with supplies, right? So that means she's come back here from time to time for some reasons. So I, I think I can come back here for like in a day or two and check is the bag still there with the food or with the key or whatever. I don't know when I did the good thing with the key. Let me know if you have been playing the console by yourself. Did you took the key or you didn't took the key or maybe you took the entire bag? Let me know. Uh, just notice that he have put the plank back. So that means that the bag is hidden once again. Uh, anything else? I don't think so. Feedback is welcome. Let me know what you think. For now though, I'm gonna cut it as over here. As I said, very interesting title. I really plan to play maybe through all of it. Let me know what you think about this idea. Though for now, I'm gonna cut it. As is over here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you liked the episode, please fix the laptops a lot. Helps you all. In the next video.